We bought our houseboat two years ago and it's time for us to do some upgrades to the interior. This weekend, we are ditching our makeshift window coverings and hanging new drapes. We are also going to do some organization and tidying up. This is my wife, Laura. This is my wife, Jackie. And this is our life. What did we do this weekend, Laura? <laughs> it was time to get rid of the drapes this weekend and we spent all of Saturday redoing the drapes here in the boat. These drapes are totally makeshift and I'm so tired of it. When I put these drapes together, what I did was I took leftover fabric that I had found in the boat. We didn't own the boat at the time. So what I did was I just kind of like took my sewing machine and sewed panels together from whatever sizes that we had. So for these ones, they went on by Velcro. But whenever I tried to stick the Velcro to the glass, the actual sticker part just melted. I'm so happy to be, to, the Velcro's gone. That's like my, I, like, that's my <laughs> happiest moment of this weekend. No more Velcro. <laughs> because window coverings cost so much money, we were really kind of just going with it, but they're hideous and we're ready to up our game a little bit. Now we have all the panels sewn. Today we're actually gonna hang them up and try to improve the whole like happy feeling in here. We're taking everything off right now and then we're gonna clean and then we're gonna put the other ones up. Sounds really simple. I'm sure it's gonna take us a long time and we will probably run into a lot of problems. We did some little organization in the kitchen. So one of the issues that we have in having such a small kitchen is we don't have a good way right now of organizing all the fruits and vegetables. What I've seen some other tiny houses do is hang a basket from underneath the cabinet. I went to Ikea and I found these baskets and we're gonna hang them up. Can't wait to put fruits and vegetables in there into my new little hanging baskets. I think that we should have lunch. All right, break's done. Break is over. It's Time to get these drapes up. Boom, let's get going. How do you feel about Ikea? I love Ikea. Ikea gives picture instructions, which I very much appreciate. We're very nervous sometimes doing like renovations or I don't know, kind of tooly building stuff. Tooly building stuff. Okay, the point <laughs> is that I'm a little bit apprehensive and anxious when putting up things that are permanent. So we were like really trying to map things out, measure. Did you find any challenges? Like talk about the hardships. Hardships, okay. I think that I just hit metal on the drill, so that's going to be a bit of an issue. I'm gonna go look to see if I drilled through the outside siding of the boat. If I have the wrong size screw, I could literally go through the boat, which would be a whole nother set of problems. 
flashback to our old rain video about leaks and everything. So it did rain this weekend too. And our bilge pump seems to be working. We don't seem to have any leaks right now. So if you haven't seen our rain video, Jackie's gonna point up to where it's gonna have a link so you can watch that. Back to the weekend of the drip. So I did not drill through the boat. Waking up this morning was so nice. Actually having something nice on your windows is just <laughs> such an improvement around here. So to wake up to something that like looks tidy and beautiful is amazing. I'm gonna FaceTime my mom right now to show her the drapes. Really? This video is sponsored by Sandy Skinner, Jackie's mom, who did all the sewing for us and got us the fabric, which was the biggest help in achieving the look and the budget and the budget <laughs> hi how are you good the drapes look amazing oh nice all that sewing was for free so or as a gift i should say if you need drapes for your boat or drapes for your house or covers put in the comments and we'll get back to you Love you take care bye it is something that we've been putting off for a long time. I'm glad we waited because we got to videotape it and show everybody. That's true. Before we show you what it looks like now, let's go back and remember what it looked like. And now are you guys ready for the reveal? Let's see it. filming and posting videos every week. We made a playlist of all of our houseboat videos and I'll put the link here so that you can watch all of them. And thank you to everybody who has already been watching and who has subscribed. If you haven't, subscribe! Signing off from another week from the Love Tub. See ya! See ya. Have you figured out how to subscribe yet? Um, I think I did. Okay.